guys! Miss Saint Nelly here and welcome back to an episode of Twilight Princess! In the last episode, we killed Diababa. And we also got a few collectibles along the way. And in this episode, we are going to be heading back into the Twilight. You guys ready for this? It's Wolfie time! Hey, it was much closer than I thought. You, need you remember, you right? Need you know what this is? If you set foot in there, you might be a wolf again for quite some time. What, what thing or at least as long as it takes for you to save the light of Elden from the twilight, anyway. So, shall we try to see the light spirit of Elden? <laughs> alright, alright, I know it's wolfy time, Midna. At least I look cool. And here it is. Big old wall of twilight. Alright, let's go. You know, you'd figure she'd find some gentler way to pull us in. You know, some really, really nice way, you know, just pick us up gently or something. But I guess not. Alright, here we are, back in the twilight. That's a good boy. Now, you need to listen to what I say from now on. As if I wasn't already. I feel so much more at ease here. And you look so much better like this than those dusty old clothes anyway. <laughs> so let's get going. Alright. Time to roam around a new area. And everything's all dark again. Uh-oh. What's this? Check out what this is. Let's sniff it. Use our sense of smell. That's right. It's Tallow's sword. You learned the youth scent. See, isn't being a wolf more convenient? Now use the side buttons on the D-pad to hone your senses. You've begun to reawaken as a wolf, I think. Alright, so, if we do this, we can see that this thing is fuming. Absolutely fuming. So is this what dogs see when they're, like, smelling crap? No wonder they smell each other's butts so often. <laughs> oh, but seriously, if, if just a... Whoa! Okay, okay, I wasn't expecting that. Holy crap, okay, oh... Uh, 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 away! Away with you! Okay, you know what? Let's see, let's see. Uh, let's... Crap, I didn't mean to just get two! Ah! Okay. Nope, 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 nope. Need the third one! There we go! Nice! And there we go! What's this? That's strange. The bridge is gone. I wonder if this is the work of those shadow creatures. Alright, so... You guys remember when we saw a bridge? You guys remember at all whatsoever? The yellow marks where we are. You knew that, right? And if you destroy those creatures from the darkness, a portal opens that looks like this on the map. You hear me? It's called a portal. You better remember that. And in those woods we came through... Yes, it's got to be around here. So, this is introducing the portal mechanic. Every place where we fight one of those shadow beasts, or a few of those shadow beasts, we open up a portal that we can warp through. So that makes traveling a lot more convenient and a lot easier. So, where did we see that bridge? Let's try North Farron Woods. See, I told you, we're here. You know, the mo most people can't leave the twilight that easily. You better be grateful. It's your job to look for the bridge. Look hard. I hope that's a joke when she says look hard because, yeah, it's right in our face, practically. 
Bridge forgot how to bridge. <laughs> Alright, what do you think? Should we take it? Warp. Good little obedient wolf. And now we take it to the Elden Province at Kakariko Gorge. Alright, time to teach this bridge how to bridge again! Okay! Minna can lift really, really freaking heavy things! Not messing with Minna! <laughs> Alright, here we go. Summoning the bridge! A lot more convenient than actually building a new one. <laughs> See? Just as I thought. <laughs> so, isn't the power of Twilight amazing? Alright, alright, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. You can warp us wherever we want, I get it. Thank you, Midna. Muchly, muchly appreciated. And, wow, it's like a, it's like a Bacoblin except Shadow. So it's a Shadow Blin. Shadow Bacoblin, whatever. Something along those lines. But these guys aren't really a threat anyway, I, I just thought that they looked kind of cool. <laughs> And we come over to a locked gate. Wonderful. Huh. What are they doing there? This is a pretty elaborate gate. What are they trying to keep in or out? Alright, so. Sense, you can dig here! I don't know why sense, because I can just dig straight up without sensing, but I just felt like it anyway. Alright, let's take these guys out. Just for the sake of taking them out, and I can't finish these guys, can I? No, I can't. I missed my finish, my finish option already. Do I get anything good? Do I get? I get a heart that I didn't need. That was a waste of time. All right, off to the next area. Welcome to Kakariko Village. Well, at least what's left of it, anyway. Got some shadow spaghetti beasts over here, which means we have another warp portal coming. Take out this one first. Come on. Let's get you two at the same time. Where is the other one? I can't see it. <sighs> I couldn't see it! That's not fair! Alright, let's get you. One. Probably should have gotten the one that's further. Alright, that's right, that's right. Come over here. Come over here. Come on. Come on. Yes! What do you mean that was too far away? That totally wasn't too far away. Okay, you know what? Get this guy first. These two are practically next to each other, so... One, two. Aha! Thought you got the best of me? No, not quite. To the hero who was transformed into a blue-eyed beast in the realm of shadows in twilight. This way. Alright, so we got another spring here. With another spirit. At least we found him easily enough. I am a spirit of light. Hero chosen by the gods. Look for my light. Gather the light stolen by the shadows into this. No! No, not this again! Not this again! I don't want the grapevine! The insects of darkness, they are, f they are the form taken by the evil that attached itself to my scattered light. In the shadowy twilight, the shadow insects are invisible, so much as the people from your light world are. With the last of my power, let me mark your map with the locations of the tears that have turned into shadow insects. But be careful, the darkness now hunts you. No! 
No! Not one! Not one! Ah. Okay, you know what? I hate this. I really hate this. Okay. Well, first things first. We need to find the little brats, because we were already looking for them. And they're somewhere in this in this building here. Uh, okay, I think I see how to get in. Yes, Midna? Yes, I, I kind of figured as much, but... Oh, I'm standing! Ah, I thought I could stay up there. Okay. Yep. Ha! Oh. And now it's time to bust through the ceiling! Alright, now if we sense... We can see that... Everyone's relatively safe. Cripes, I don't see those black brutes anywhere. Gotta be hiding somewhere, waiting for our, their helpless little prey to come out. Then they'll feast! And yeah, way to comfort the kids. We are safe as long as we remain in here, child. Be at ease. Oh yeah, I wonder if those monsters out there agree with you. They sure didn't seem impressed by my bombs. How long do you think we can hold this sanctuary against the beast that strong, huh? Once they attack, it's over. Wow, poor kids! You're a jerk! Remember the lady from the general store? Just one of those things attacked her and a whole gang from the town went to save her. And what happened? She was already gone. And there were two monsters waiting. Connecting the dots, that means if we get attacked by them, then we'll be... Barnes! <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Nicely done, jerk. Look, Renato. All I mean to say is that it's risky here, too. Ain't you got some place we can hide? There is a cellar. <laughs> Alright, so we got a cellar. The entrance to the cellar is designed to open when all the candles have been lit. I would not do that. When Father instructed me to secure the cellar, I saw insects like the beasts outside. Don't cry, Beth. It'll be okay. So! Aww! Even in all this, he's still faithful. Huh? Hmm. Had a little bit of hope that the kids needed. I can feel it. If only you knew. If only you knew. Those kids knew you'd come save them. What a hero. That's how sad to be right in front of someone and not being noticed at all. You seem to be getting a little bit of pleasure out of this. All right, and only that keeps you from turning into a spirit or worse, into a dark monster when you enter twilight and no one knows what you have done may be doomed to toil in obscurity forever. You're the type to worry about everything I can tell, but don't fret up over Princess Zelda. She chose this state of affairs after all. Anyway, what's with having to light candles to get into the basement? Not very subtle, is it? So, what are you going to do now, my lonely little hero? <laughs> Ah, Midna, 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 you insecure little, little jerk. Alright, so, we got the stick! I got a stick! I got a stick! Wolfie likes a stick! But we can't really hang on to it for long, so let's light both ends of this. I'm setting them on fire! No, not really. You know, you'd figure that they would actually see, like, a floating stick around floating stick on fire at that and kind of be, I don't know, panicking a little? Oh crap, these actually do go out. Okay, so I gotta do this quick. Can't mess around too much. Alright. No, 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 not throw! Not throw! What are you doing throwing it? Okay. Okay. You know what? You know what? There. Okay, so I just walk normal. Don't... Why is this difficult? 
Why is this so difficult? This is not something difficult to do. This is not difficult to do. Come on. One. Two. Three. And four. Alright, so we opened up the cellar. Let's see if they say in anything interesting now. What sorcery is this? <laughs> All right, so into the cellar. And now we were tipped off that there's insects down here. Three of them. Very, very, very helpful. Come on, come on, die. Aha! And now dig a hole, dig a hole. Want dig a hole? There we go. There we go. We got that, got that, and that. So we got three already. That's that is very helpful. And now we can head outside. Power. All right. Looks so like you can climb the scaffolding. All right. So let's do this. I love how my balance is just miraculously increased just by having Midna point us at stuff. All right. So here's a Kakariko graveyard. Come on, with, with bugs underneath. There we go. Come on. No, did it already dig back down? No way. Come on. Oh, no, there it is. Aha, dead. Come on. You pretty shiny. I like pretty shiny. I do indeed like how it gives me hearts. That is very, very nice and very generous of this game. Alright, so now we're in Kakariko Village. Let's go into the town, and I see something in here. So let's figure out where we can actually get in from. Oh! Oh no, 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 not this thing, not this thing. Get away from me! Get away from me! Get away from me! Oh, I hate these things! Die! Die! Explode into your puffy black pink boom of death! Ugh, not like, not like, I don't like that. Must say, is not a happy camper with those things around. At all. Alright, so we got, we have a sort of store here. And... Wait a second. Ah! It's like right in front of my face. There we go. Give us back our light, little insect. There we go. Do I get anything worthwhile from these? At all? Nothing. It looks like a store. There should be like supplies in here or something. Hey, money! I just robbed a store. I don't think anyone really cares. All right, so back out we go. No, 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 no. No. Up, down, out. There we go. Okay, so that takes care of a good chunk of these insects. Now there should be one somewhere in this building. Except I can't get in there. Wait a second, wait a second. We should be able to like get on top of the building somewhere over here. Let's go this way. Climb up. Aha! I see! Let's see, is there anything of interest in here? I'm betting there is because of the mini-map. So let's see. Where are you? Where are you? Aha! Uh, and it, it's some. It's in there. I need. I need fire. I need fire. And I need to take out these guys. Hey, okay, come on. Up. Oh, dead. Dead. Want you dead? Want you dead? Want you dead? I said. Okay. Go and treasure chest! Treasure chest! Open, open! Red rupee that I can't take. So let I hate that! I hate that how I find stuff and then I can't I can't put it into my wallet anyway. There should be an option or something. That'd be really freaking nice. 
Come on, get up. Get up so I can keep chewing on your face. There we go. Thank you. Whoa! That was that was not very pleasant. Okay, wait a second. Here it is. Come on. Ouch. Bam! There we go, we got that one. And now I need fire. Now I need fire. Where can I get fire? Stick. A stick. Masay needs a stick. Masay is not finding a stick. Anywhere. Oh, uh, let's see. Come on, I see you up there. I need to flush you out with fire, but, uh... Hmm. Where, where is... There's a stick right in front of the freaking thing. Wow. Okay. Okay. I know. Masay is a derp. No. Okay, well, that works, I guess. There we go! Not my fault if this place burns to the ground! Come on. Die. Why can't I fight these things all of a sudden? It's like they're getting smarter. Alright. There we go. Come on. Get up. Sweet. Okay, is there anything else? Is there anything else? I don't think so. I don't think so. Okay, yeah, I got everything. Sweet, 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 sweet. And now we just have to head outside. Outside somewhere. Yo. Up. 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 And out. Sorry, person, whoever owns this building. I think I set your building on fire. Actually... Wow, uh, this has been going on for quite a while, and we still have half of the little mm -hmm. vessel grapevine thingy to go. So, I think we're going to take a break here, and in the next episode, we're going to be wrapping up our light finding. So, I will see you guys then. Messina, out. <laughs>